If you guys are looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 21 coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. Coins are currently discounted, guys. They got 24-7 support. They're super awesome to work with. Head on over, use code Poodle for an additional 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, essentially, this video is going to be like a Sunday preview for the rest of the week. Now, if you guys like this type of video, let me know. I will start doing these every Sunday because I feel like Sunday we got football. It's less about Madden. We want to know what's coming up, but we may not actually play too much of it on Sunday. So, let me know if you like this style of video to do every Sunday. I think this would be pretty cool. It's like a Sunday preview, what we can expect for this week, kind of where Madden's trending. It's like a Sunday like roundup of just like, okay, where are we at in Madden now? I think this could be a cool concept. Let's see how this goes. I'm going to try to be doing it. If you guys do enjoy it, I will start doing it more on Sundays. Hopefully, I think, I think this is a great idea, but that's just me. Now, guys, as you guys do know, you want a chance to be shouted out in today's or any day's Poodle Squad, all you got to do is go down below, like the video, turn on the noti bell, turn on all notifications, and comment down below, Poodle Squad. Now, for today's Poodle Squad shout out, Aaron Wise, shout out to you, man, for being part of the Poodle Squad. Thank you so much for your day in and day out support each and every day, commenting, liking videos, and so on and so forth. All you guys got to do is follow the steps, like, noti bell, comment. Once you do know all those things, you will have a chance to be shouted out. Good luck to each and every one of you. Again, everyone's going to eventually be shouted out just on the basis of how many comments I usually get. Eventually, for the most part, maybe I'll start doing two a day as well if things start to pick up and I feel like I'm not getting to everyone. But that's it for that. Let's get into the video. So guys, for this week, what do we got up? Uh, what do we got on the table for this week in terms of what we're going to be dealing with? So we got a few things. I have about six things to go over here in terms of what we expect. So, so let's start with Monday. Starting tomorrow, guys, we do have Ulton kickoff stuff coming. Now, what could we be expecting? They called it small, but they called it new. So the thing is, I was hoping for another kickoff master. It appears clear that we will not be getting another kickoff master because they said it's going to be small. So could we get an LTD? Possibly. But they said they're working on it because they don't want it to be buggy. Could it be more solos? Possibly, but some solos typically don't be worked on that much. Usually they got those down packed. Could it be a house rules for a free hero? Possibly. Could it be, let's see, a little a little interesting thing like uh, some some gambling type stuff where like you, you pick a card, coin up type cards, like how we had the, the other thing with the Russell Wilsons, possibly. Now, so I don't think it's Master. I think it more along the lines will be something with some way of making coins, solos for rewards, or maybe a house rules. Because if they're testing it, I don't really see a scenario where they're testing something or unless they're doing a solo battles oriented around kickoff somehow. Not sure in that sense, but that is what we tomorrow on the docket. We for sure got kickoff stuff, so that's exciting. Today, of course, just football. Tomorrow, all that. So now Tuesday, we have team of the week. Now, guys, team of the week, as you guys do know, super fun weekly stuff. Now, last week's team of the week, we did get Devontae Adams, Aaron Foster, and Bryant Young as our three guys, and then of course we got some other stuff. We got like the collectibles. We got the power up expansion level stuff. Super cool. We got TJ Watt. Team of the Week was just awesome last week. I really liked it. So if it's the same mold every week, we will be seeing an offensive and defensive legend S flashback, a player of the week for our current day life, and hopefully an LTD. Now, who can we predict for those? Predictions for predictions. Uh, who could have a big week this week, guys? Honestly, I feel like Clyde could have a big week. Clyde Edwards Alaire. Of course, would they give it to him? Probably not because he's a rookie premiere. You know, it's the same guys. I mean, I, I feel like Kyler is due for one of those big team of the weeks. Last year, he didn't get a single hero, I don't believe. I believe, I'm almost positive he always only got the lower cards. What I would love to see Kyler Murray hero would be one of the top quarterbacks in Madden. Now, that is what we got dealing with team of the week stuff. Of course, that will be Tuesday. We can expect about four cards, one LTD, three heroes, basic stuff, some new solos. Make sure you're getting your tokens done by Tuesday because you will they will expire and you will miss out. And now, moving on from that, guys, on um, Wednesday... We got, I believe, heavyweights, which you guys are going to know the deal with that. Uh, just big boys. Now, the thing is, they did it on wildcard Wednesday. So, my thing now, I'm thinking, is it wildcard Wednesday a random person, like like heavyweights? Or is it heavyweights and wildcard Wednesday? Or was wildcard Wednesday heavyweights? My theory was that it was six players, three were the heavyweights, and the additional three, or was five players. And the additional two were the wildcard Wednesday. That was my, that was my initial thinking. So, I don't know if that's going to be how it is. So, of course, we'll see. But as of now, I'm going with, we do have wild card uh we have wild card wednesday and we have heavyweights so expect like two or three heavyweights and then a wild card wednesday now wild card wednesday can be anything from current promos it could be uh it could be a random drop of a legend like uh let's just say Deion sanders on wednesday right it could be michael vick i doubt they do that but i'm just saying it could be an extra ultimate kickoff player like an extra hero just random like calvin ridley 88 hero it could be 
literally anything that we have in the, just in the game though ultimate kickoff superstar mvp it could be just about anything they've released so do expect a wild card wednesday drop as well so so far for the week we got wild card wednesday um team of the week and we got kickoff news tomorrow and we got heavyweights and then of course on thursday guys i think we do get thursday ltds now that's my theory there as well as you guys do know this past thursday they did drop surprise ltds but they weren't kickoff ltds it was one kickoff and two just regular style ltds which makes me believe that we which makes me believe that we will be getting just random ltds on thursday so aaron Rodgers and denzel ward were random thursday ltds like quite literally just dropped randomly denzel ward was a thursday night player but aaron Rodgers was not so could there be one it could just be one that performed great on a thursday night and then one who is playing on thursday night it's possible um but for the most part guys the other one was jamal adams but jamal adams was a kickoff ltd that was like that's a thing he was kickoff these could be like the new version of signature series which is super cool actually these are really good last year signature series were not that good like most of the cards dropped people weren't really caring for these were actually really good six series drops so hopefully they keep that up we can expect that thursday then friday if I'm not wrong, if I don't stand corrected here, we have a legend preview as probably the only thing as of now that we know of. Now, guys, I do expect the 50 news. Now, if you guys know what the 50 is, the 50 has been their long hinted promo that should be coming, uh, I believe, between now and most feared. So, most feared would be like second week, middle of October. I expect I expect the 50 to come out between now and the first week of October. So, between now and October 6th, sometime between then, that leaves us like two weeks, two weeks and a half, give or take. So, we should be getting news in the near future, or at least some kind of references. I do hope that Kralo maybe tomorrow or anytime this week gives us news. So that's what I'm putting on the, on, on the schedule for this week. If we do get some news from Kralo in terms of the 50. Now the 50, I think it's going to be some way of dropping like legend LTDs. Like kind of how Mutt 10 was or NFL 100 was. Somewhere along those lines. Now, Mutt 10 would be fun, but those are LTDs. Maybe I prefer the NFL 100. NFL 100 last year was like quarterbacks this week and running backs. They dropped like 10 of them. Uh, wide receivers, tight ends, they dropped like 7 of them. However many they do. It was pretty fun it, it was it was a fun time i just feel like they dropped too many cards so maybe mutt would be a better drop but again we'll see i don't know if it'll be a big promo or like a weekly drop we have to see on that but i do think it could be exciting and it has potentials potential and then of course guys for saturday which will be the final day of the week uh, in terms of mutt related streams and news we will be getting legends so this week we did get lawrence taylor and reggie wayne which we are picking up on the legend heat now that's a good drop right there so we got them so hopefully this next Saturday, we can finally see our Deion Sanders. But I feel like typically they alternate a good release with a bad release. So, like, Tony Gonzalez and John Lynch were good. Like, not bad. Let's say subpar. Like, Tony Gonzalez and John Lynch were good, but it wasn't like everyone's dropping their wallets. This week, we got Reggie Wayne and Lawrence Taylor. Everyone's dropping their wallets. Now, next week could be, like, maybe the outside linebacker on the, on the Steelers. I wish I got his name. Uh, Kevin Green. Kevin Green and, like, Keith Bullock, right? Let's just say. And then the following week could be, like, Deion Sanders and something. Uh, Deion Sanders and Kevin Moy, right? That could be expected, but that's pretty much it for this video. I think that covers everything. We got 50 wild card kickoff, team of the week, Thursday LTDs, heavyweights, legends, and then that following Sunday again. If you guys like the style of video, I will do it again. And then, of course, we will go over what's coming the following week. You guys, about it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Again, shout out to the Poodle Squad, Aaron Wise. Thank you so much for showing support. If you guys want a chance? Again, all you gotta do is like, turn on the notification bell and comment down below Poodle Squad. That's about it, guys. If you need coins to pick up any players for this upcoming week of content, go over to MarReserve.com. Use code Poodle at checkout for an additional 15% off of currently discounted coins. Go take advantage. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.